morning, YouTube, Friday, finally, of course, don't make me no never mind, every day can be a Friday, but I prefer every day to be a Saturday, it's my preference, grab your cup of joe, let's go. Everything's good. Had some things to take care of yesterday, and then in the process, I swung through Walmart. Got a new coffee maker. So, everybody is safe now. The world is back tilted to the right side. Been busy this week. Getting ready, you know. Well, we had to get ready to have the guy come look at the basement and then we had to get ready to get some other things done here real quick. Get ready for the holiday weekend. By the way, it is Red Shirt Friday. Remember, everyone deployed. But anyways, being busy and I, I had absolutely no time to prepare for, for a Freedom Friday, but there will be a video later, but just not uh, discussing uh, groceries, produce, you know. Oh, so there will, but there will be a video later. Little, little. So little surprise that I managed to uh, work into the schedule of getting crap done. Since uh, Monday is the holiday. <coughs> Not going to be able to uh, get out on Monday. Oh, beautiful day. 57 degrees outside, 62 in here, according to Piper Dave, weather station. Sun is shining. They've covered their bases. They're saying there's a chance of rain, which for the last four days, there's been a chance of rain with only one day that actually had some rain. You know, just enough to mess up the clean on the truck. Uh, let me get... Let me get turned so I can uh, face y'all. Getting ready. Uh, my brother and sister-in-law be in here. And my boys will be down. Figure out what's on the menu. Get it taken care of. Mom's doing okay right now, you know, no more, no more episodes.
she's almost back to her, her old self. I mean, she did she did manage to get in a couple uh I need to be cleaning the garage. I need to be cleaning my room or something, you know. So I'm actually I'm actually looking forward to my brother being here because her attention will be diverted. Let him get a little bit of it. He's got he's got boxes of junk packed up for him to take home so he can have junk at his house. I take the junk from here, move it somewhere else. We're good. Now it's their problem. Oh boy, oh boy. We got the uh, got an eye doctor appointment coming up. Yeah, sometime in next month, which we're getting close to next month. This was a long month between paydays, let me tell you. Was it five weeks? Oh. Come on, open up. I'll just let that sit there until it opens up. So. It ain't going to open up. We'll close that one. We'll try to go in this way. Uh huh. There we go. Uh, Tuesday, six eighteen at ten thirty a.m. in Akron, Ohio. Yeah, we'll be strapped when we go in that neighborhood for sure. That's my my eye doctor. You gotta have a special one when you have diabetes, apparently. But the last two times I've I've gone and seen her, no change in my eyes, so no new glasses, which is really very cost effective that way. And I don't notice anything different now, so who knows? Oh, man. Well, anyways, that's my morning. It's been a good morning. Almost, almost got two hours of straight sleep last night. Almost. Oh. My uh, my primary care. She won't. Uh, she won't prescribe any good stuff. No, no opiates. It's always you know Tylenol or Aleve. So. But I got a. I got a bottle. I saved the bottle from Cindy. Cindy had 
forget what she had. Well, what she was prescribed. She had uh, fibromyalgia, which is, you know, chronic pain. <clears throat> but I try not, I, I got to save them. I can't, you know, I can't take them every day. I got to save them for those really, really bad days. I had groceries delivered yesterday. And I get a phone call, you know, because they, they keep you informed. We are we are now doing your shopping, whatever, you know. And mom drinks mom gets the, the eight ounce bottles of water. They were on sale. But they ain't we wanted four. They only had one. Would you like to substitute the full size, the 12 ounce, 16 ounce, whatever? No, don't, don't. You know, replace, you know, substitute other eight or 10 ounce bottles. It will be fine. Well, guy shows up and delivers the groceries. He carries in the little bottles of water and he says, I got more. I'm like, what? Shouldn't. Then he carries in three 24 packs of the big bottles. So we look at the receipt. And, well, oh, yeah, they charged us. Oh, wait, down here, nope, they voided them out. So we didn't pay for them. So to do the right thing, Give him a call. Say, man, you screwed up. You sent these. And you shouldn't have. And we didn't pay for them. And she goes, oh, well, you can just return them to the store. And I'm like, oh, no. Not me. I didn't make this mistake. You want them, you come get them. At the end of the conversation, she says, you just keep them. And that is why places are going out of business every day because somebody goes ah just keep them and that is why for 41 years i worked for myself nobody to blame but me Hope you're well. Hope you're safe. Every day is a school day. If you're not learning, you are being left behind. I will see y'all this afternoon, later, sometime or another. Peace.